So let's talk about the male reproductive and urinary system. Your bladder is here, your urethra runs through here, through the penis, and out your external urethral opening. Let's talk for a second about a terp. So as you can see, this is your bladder. Your urethra, where your urine comes out, runs through here and out. This is your prostate. Now what happens to men when they get older is commonly their prostate will enlarge. When it does, it will start to infringe upon this opening. It'll start to close it off. It causes problems with urination. So quite commonly they will have a terp done with transmitting through or across. Urethra is the opening. Resection means you're cutting sections out of it. Prostate is the anatomy. Transurethral resection of a prostate, a terp. So what are we doing? We're cutting sections of it out. So if it enlarges and then it starts to infringe upon this opening, starts to close it up to have trouble urinating, they can come in with a scope and a resector scope and cut little pieces of it out to open that back up again. So this is your bladder neck, this is your prostate. Cut those pieces out and it will open that channel back up again. They're gonna do that back to the ejaculatory ducts, right? which are these coming in here. This is called the vera monotanum. We're gonna stop here because they don't want to damage the ejaculation ducts. This is where your sperm will come through because this is right where your external sphincter for your urine. This is part of the way that men control their urination. So if you damage that, they become incontinent and can't control or hold their bladder. They're gonna cut part of this prosthetic tissue out. This is not a prostatectomy which is to cut the whole thing out. This is just a terp where you're just resecting part of it. So don't get those two confused. So that is one thing that they can do with an enlarged prostate to help um, open up this channel once again.